What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since my last post, but if you saw my personal trainer course video, you'll remember that I became a certified personal trainer. So I've been focusing on that while juggling a full-time job. So I needed a little break from my videos, but I'm back. Today's video is what a realistic self-care Sunday looks like to me. While I would love to just relax in a spa all day, there are things I still need to get done to prepare myself for the week. And to me, making time for them is a form of self-care. So I start off by making the bed. During the week, we're always on the go, 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 so we don't really get time to do the bed. But on the weekends, I like to start the day with one productive thing. Then I get ready for my Sunday 10 a.m. workout class. This is a 30 minute class on Zoom that I was giving for free. I like working out on Sundays because I feel like it sets me up for the rest of the week. So once I am in my gym clothes, I of course need to hydrate. Drink about like three glasses of water early in the morning. Then I check my phone. Just make sure I answer any last minute questions. Make sure everybody has the link to the class. And of course, my pre-workout. I take dry shots uh, because I just don't think I have the time to just sip my pre-workout. And I know a lot of people think I'm crazy, but it works for me. It's 10 o'clock, so let's get started. So my 30 minute workouts are usually full body workouts. These are for people on the go that don't really have time to work out every day and just need something quick to get moving. So I really enjoy doing these workouts, especially on Sundays, you know, we don't have too much time, but we still want to get a workout in. So I try to get the most in these 30 minutes. And of course, after every workout, I am soaked because working out and talking is next level. After my workout, I make sure I clean up right away. I usually clean on Saturdays, so I still want to keep up with the house. Plus, on Sundays, it makes me feel good to see everything organized. And I know after my workouts, it could get a little crazy. This is also where the realistic part of my Sunday comes in because I still need to keep the place organized and it makes me feel good. So I have breakfast and then, of course, I have some errands to run. So I'm going to do that so I can have the rest of the evening to myself. Once I've done all my errands, I make sure I put time aside to wash my hair, which is a whole other process, and call my family members, usually my mom and my sister, catch up on everything. I do have a skincare routine and it's super simple, just a serum and lotion. <laughs> Then I like to organize my super messy desk just so I can start the week with something already organized. And I also like to plan out my week, whatever I have coming up, anything that I need to do. So I'm not thinking about it during the week. Finally, I can relax and watch some senseless television. And that is my realistic self-care Sunday. I hope you all enjoyed the video and I'll catch you next time.